We don't all breathe the same air. In the United States, on average, air pollution exposures are higher for people of color than for white people, even after accounting for differences in income. It hasn't been known, however, whether this unequal exposure is due mainly to a few source types, such as refineries and waste dumps, or instead, whether it is more systemic across emission sources. In this paper, we show that for the vast majority of pollution source types, exposures are higher for people of color than for white people. This is true for the country overall, and also for most individual cities and states, and for people at all income levels. For black Americans, exposures are higher than average for all major categories of emissions. That means that reducing emissions from only a small number of sources or source categories will not fix the problem. Exposures from some emission categories, such as motor vehicles, industry, and construction, stand out as having especially large racial-ethnic disparities. Our paper contains information about which source types are the biggest contributors to inequitable exposures in each U.S. city and state. This information can be used to address disparities and improve the air in all communities. For further details, please see our article published in Science Advances.